Hey what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video on the channel today. Today guys we're at episode number 11 of the Newcastle Final Action Takeover career mode in FIFA 20. Now as you can see we've got Bournemouth next in the league. We are going to go over to the calendar and show you guys what we've got in store for today's episode. We, like I said we've got Bournemouth away. Then we have a game against West Ham at home. And we travel down to Man City uh, for an away game which is going to be a tough one. Because I think, I don't know if they're top of the league or check after this. Then we've got Sheffield United and then we've got the all important FA Cup semi-final. Uh, and then the next episode we'll have these games and maybe the FA Cup final we can beat Liverpool to get there. Um, but what we're going to do is check the table quickly uh, for the standings. So we're currently sat 6th. Um, obviously we've got uh, two games um, to catch up to Chelsea, level on games with Spurs who are on 62 and we actually have to play Spurs soon in uh, the next episode which is quite important. So Man City is second, Liverpool first, United third. Okay so top four is on the card still, it's just a matter of if we can actually go off and pull that off. Um, but I'm going to hopefully try and get to the FA Cup final win that for you guys. Um, and even if we can just get Europa League next season, I wouldn't even mind that. Um, but if you do go on to enjoy the video, please leave a like, comment and subscribe if you're new around here. We're just going to go straight into the action here against Bournemouth. Let's see how we get on. Right then guys, first game of the episode against Bournemouth. Away from home. Can we um, try and pick up from the last game we did play, which was against Villa. We lost 1-0. Hopefully we can. We need to start picking up these wins again. And hopefully we can climb the table. Let's see how we get on. He slide in Almiron. That's actually a really nice pass. Here comes Almiron. Gonna have to wait for some support. De La Vega, can he get the shot away? It's 1-0 to Newcastle United. Lovely, lovely counter-attack there from Newcastle. Martinez and Almiron putting in the work. And De La Vega coming up towards the end of the attack there. Bringing the ball. One touch inside. And he bangs it into the back of the net. Five goals for him in his debut Premier League season. Which is really, really nice to see. Anyway, one and up now. Let's see if we can try and get another goal. Bournemouth again playing that ball over the top. Willem's out of position. Cuts it back. Plays it through. Good save by Dubravka. Pretty easy one in the end. Going to throw this out to St. Maxim. Run it down the line. Inside now. Samar. Is that Martinez on the ball? Yeah. Waiting for that run of Samar. St. Maxim down the line. Cut inside. St. Maxim. Martinez is there. Can he get the shot away? Oh, what a save by the keeper there. Oh, my God. Last ditch hands to the ball. Almiron whips it in. Shah is there. Oh, can't get his head onto it. Conate. We go all the way back to Almiron. Can he get the shot away? It's blocked. No rebound there for us. And here come Bournemouth. But we've won the ball back. Lovely interception from uh, Camavinga, I think that was. It was. Martinez, oh what a turn that is from Martinez, Martinez can he get the shot away, oh it's blocked and it's half time, can we get the tackle in, Shah does a little bit, oh Williams shouldn't have really dived in there, what a tackle from Canate, can he get rid of it, Camavinga now, Almiron, oh it's a great tackle from Almiron there, Martinez waiting for that runner, De La Vega, he's going around the outside, De La Vega, puts it inside, He's still going. Oh, he's done well. De La Vega. Saved by the keeper. Oh, I should have scored there. Should have probably laid that back to Martinez or something. Anyway, corner. Martinez. That's awful. Here come Bournemouth. Down the line. Stanislas cuts it in. Plays it all the way back. Oh, De La Vega's intercepted it. Need some options here. Almiron, can he find St. Maxim? Yes, he can. That's a great pass. St. Maxim playing some 1-2 over Martinez. Camavinga's through. Can he get the shot away? Penalty, surely. Surely, it is. It's a penalty. Billing, I think that is. Giving a straight red card for that challenge on Camavinga. Terrible, um, terrible challenge. Right, let's try and go top corner here with Martinez. And what a penalty that is. Straight into the top corner. And it's 2-0 now. Bournemouth down to 10. I don't see them coming back into this game after that red card. 2-0 up now. Martinez coolly slots it into the top corner. No pressure at all. Bangs it. Lovely, lovely penalty. And we're tuning up now. That should be game over. Bournemouth now. Oh, wow. It's a great ball. We have to get rid of it now. Almiron playing it down the left-hand side. Counter-attack opportunity. Tongi. He's got so much space. So much space. Just going to go all the way with him. Can he cross it now? 
Oh, I've probably done the wrong idea, but anyway, Kamavinga. Yulinton turns, gets the shot away, it's 2, it's 3-0. Yulinton gets another goal in the series. This man is on absolute fire in the past three episodes. He's done it again, what a turn, what a shot. Kamavinga spins the defender, plays it into him. Yulinton touches it away from the defender and smashes it into the bottom corner. It's 3-0 and that's game over. Oh, Tongi's won the ball back deep in the... Half of Bournemouth, I didn't mean to do that touch. He's still got the ball, can he shoot? He's got his goal! Tongi! 4-0, I think that's his first goal for the club if, I not mis if I'm not mistaken. His first Premier League goal since signing in January. 4-0 now, I think that, that red card has really killed off Bournemouth. Um, it was a quite a close game until that um, that red card and penalty to go 2-0 up. Ever since then, I've just absolutely battered them in terms of the possession. And uh, the chances created. Can we get one more chance before the end of the game? Tongi's really making a run at the back post there. Can he get the shot away? Saved. Rebound. To corner. One last chance. Before the game ends. Shah is there. Almon is going to get that. He's offside. Oh, Yolinton. Oh, it's unlucky. Goal kick. I mean, it's 95 minutes with 92 added. So that should be game over. As the goalkeeper kicks it. 4-0. Uh, we're still playing for some reason. There we go. 96 minutes of two. Anyway, great win. Great start to the episode. Let's jump into the next game of the episode. Right then, guys. Second game of the episode against West Ham at home. Let's see if we can continue our form from the first game. Very impressive start to the episode. Hopefully we can. Let's see how we get on. Here come West Ham to start off the game. Haller running in through. Plays it back to Anderson. Back to Haller. Here we go. West Ham coming through. Kadir they got Kadira as well. That's a weird signing. Didn't expect um, someone like Sammy Kadira to join West Ham. Again, I, I just can't get the ball off them. And here they come. Wilshire through. Konate misses the tackle. Cresswell. And we've finally got the ball back. Now we can counter attack here. De La Vega. Can he play Martinez? That's a great pass. And Martinez has got the pace. I can't really see where the ball is. It's 1-0. I mean, I just don't know what happened there. West Ham were keeping the ball really well. Took the ball. Played one big through ball at the pitch. Martinez runs through. And he smashes it into the back of the net. But I just couldn't really see the ball and the player properly. Because Martinez and the sunlight and the shadow just didn't really blend in well. Anyway, we're 1-0 up. Let's see if we can keep this um, start off going. Born up. Snodgrass taking it. Ball whipped into the back stick. Out by uh, Kamavinga, I think that was. But West Ham still got the ball now. Kadira down the line. Into Philippe Anderson now. Good tackle from Willems to Maxim. Can he get on to the end of that? Yes, he can. Now I'm just going to burst away with him against Mark Noble. St. Maxim is going to be absolutely blitzing Mark Noble here. Can we play it inside to Almiron? Oh, what a goal that is from Miguel Almiron. I didn't expect it to go in, to be honest. I thought I'd kind of risked it. Risked it. Oh, my God. By taking the half volley there. Bang. What? Oh, the keeper pushed it in. That's why. Okay. Anyway. It's still a goal, though, isn't it? Look at that, Almiron. Keeper couldn't keep it out. Too much power on it. How many goals is that for Almiron now? 13 goals in the Premier League. You'd love to see it. We're 2-0 up now, and we're looking pretty comfortable in this game. Martinez now. Through to St. Maxim. Cuts it in. Can he get the shot away? St. Maxim saved by the keeper. Almiron on the rebound. Kamavinga's there. It's blocked. Oh, we can't get another chance. And Fabianski just boots it out of play. Hitting the cameraman there. We've got a chance here. They could make some subs. 20 minutes or so left. Oh, I didn't mean that. Um, we're going to bring Foden on. But I think Kamavinga, he's just looking a bit tired there. Uh, we're also going to take off Almiron. Bring on... Uh, Tongi in at Cal. I'm going to bring Luca Bacchio on as well uh, for this last 20 or so minutes. Let's see if we can um, pick up where we were just then. Trying to get a goal again. Tongi plays it all the way to Somar. Martinez. Luca Bacchio. That's a good touch. Can he get the cross in? Ball's whipped in. Fabianski's there. Martinez. Oh, he's trying to go for the header. Still got the chance though. No, we don't because the ball's been cleared away. But. Shah wins the header. Somar. Oh, no. What is that? Konate. Oh, that's a really bad tackle. 
And it's a red card for Canate. Oh no. He misses the game against Man City. And that is a really bad tackle. I thought I was going to get the ball and I completely mistimed it. It's a red card for Canate. The Maxim now driving down the line. It's going to go all the way around Fredericks like he's not even there. So Maxim going to wait for someone to make a run in the box. Oh, that's an awful cross. That's full time though. I'll take the 2-0 win against West Ham. Now we have to jump into a game against Man City, which is a very, very big game for our title for uh, top four um, race. Let's see how we get on. Right then, guys, moving on into arguably the biggest game of the season for us. Man City are sat in second, I do believe. We are sat in about sixth. No, yeah, sixth now. Um, we are three points behind Chelsea. 11 on points, I think, with Spurs or near enough uh, on level par with them. Um, if we could get any, we need to, arguably, we need to win this game to try and keep up with the top four um, race. Let's see how we get on. Lovely play. Martinez is through. Can I get the goal? Martinez! 1-0 against Man City. 26 minutes gone and we're one up. Martinez and Alboron again linking up perfectly. These two are on fire together. Bangs it into the top corner. We're 1-0 up against City. Let's see if we can carry this on. Man City now. Sane with the ball. Play through to De Bruyne. And it's square to Aguero. And it's 1-1. Oh my god, man. That's probably my bad defensive wise. I didn't really close Sane down at all. And it's now 1 1 in this game. Camavinga plays in Martinez. One touch, finish, and we scored straight away. Oh my days, Martinez is on fire. Man City have equalised, and we've gone up the other end from kickoff. Played some lovely football there. Martinez gets his 19th league goal of the season, and we're now 2 1 up again. De Bruyne now plays it through to Sane, and he scored out of nothing. Oh my days, no way has Sane just scored. I should have won the ball. De Bruyne, I should have won the ball there, and he still got the ball. I thought he might have been offside. 2 2. What a crazy game this has been. Can he slide in St. Maxim? He can. Need to get a. Oh, that's a great touch. Martinez. Oh, I can't get the shot away. Camavinga's missed the tackle. Here come Man City. Bernardo Silva. Can we chase this down? Yes, good tackle from Camavinga. Throw in for City. PK's coming on for Man City. Um, bit of a strange one, that. But anyway, here come Man City again with Aguero. 65 minutes. We're probably going to make some subs in a minute just to uh, bring on some fresh legs. Party now. Can't make the tackle. Oh, my God. What a goal. Oh, my God. Oh, what the hell? How's that gone in? There's no way that's just gone in. Thomas Party has just absolutely smashed that into the top corner. Oh, we have to go um, make some subs, I think. Oh, my God. That's not what you want to see. Luka back is going to come on. I'm going to bring Jolinton on as well. Um, I'm going to play Martinez in behind Jolinton, and then I'm probably going to bring on... Uh, I'm going to keep it like that for now. Um, we are chasing the game now, though. 3-2 to Man City. Linton now. A lot of space. Martinez. Can he find Linton? He can. He's thrown goal. Linton. It's straight at the keeper. Edison saves. Corner now. St. Maxim whips it in. Fabian Shah. Can't get ahead onto it. Ball's just been smashed back in. Here comes Bernardo Silva now. Switch of the play all the way to Cancelo. Oh, we need to get a goal quickly. Good tackle from Smart. Still can't get the ball though, even where we've tackled Cancelo. Oh my god, Samar, that is lovely play. St. Maxim. Can he find Samar again? Yulinton's in the middle. Yulinton, can he shoot? Yulinton, it's saved again by Edison. No way. St. Maxim whips it in. No one can get onto the end of that. Willems. Camavinga now, my, no, Maxim, sorry. Oh, he's lost the ball. Got the ball back, though. Oh, my God, we lost it again. Right, let's take our time here. Camavinga, Martinez, your Linton's there. What is that for a pass? Lovely turn. Can he find Martinez? Oh, it's not a good pass at all. Closing stage of this game, and we're chasing it, and here comes Sane over the top. 
He's got Aguero in the middle. He's found him. What a save from Dubravka. St. Maxim wins it. Oh, no, it's Willem's there. You're Linton now. St. Maxim. Inside. Lovely. Martinez. You're Linton. Can he find Martinez? He can't. That is a shocking pass. We need to push up the pitch here. Oh, wow. We're into literally the last minute of the game. Shah wins the header. You're Linton. Samar. Martinez, Luca Bacchio slides in Yulinton. Yulinton cuts it inside. Yulinton misses the first chance. Second chance. Goal! Yulinton has scored in the 91st minute to make it 3 3 against City. Scenes you love to see. We've come back and snatched the point late on against Man City. I don't think we're going to have time to have another chance. But look at this. Um, Yulinton misses the first chance, gets the second chance. And it's now 3-3 in this game against City. Last chance of the game, I do think, for either side. And that is full-time, 3-3. What a game. And we move on into the last game of the episode. Right then, guys, moving on into the next game of the episode. Sorry, it's not the last game because I forgot we had this game against Sheffield United before we play the FA Cup semi-final against Liverpool. Um, so, obviously, scenes in the uh, end of the last game. Hopefully we can um, try and pick up um, and get a win against Sheffield United. I think it's vital that we win this game just due to the fact of the um, the table at the moment. And then obviously after this game we do have the FA Cup semi-final against uh, Liverpool. And here come Sheffield United starting off. Anyway, yeah, so we do have the um, FA Cup semi-final which will be the last game of the episode in the next game. But we've got to get through Sheffield United first. Let's see how we get on. And Kilo plays it down the line to De La Vega. Delavega going to run through. No, he's not. Gets tackled there by the defender. Shaw, are you going to win that? Yes, he does. Camavinga. Can he slide in St. Maxim? He can. St. Maxim. Good save by the keeper. Delavega misses it. Amaron shoots. Oh, my God. Look how lucky that is. But we don't care. It's 1-0. Almiron gets another goal this season. Since we've moved into that cam spot, he's played absolutely incredible for us. But... All I can say for that goal is, I'm sorry, that was just so jammy. 14 league goals for him this season. 11 minutes in and we've taken the lead already. So, I mean, let's see if we can try and get a couple more goals to kill off the game early on. Is it down the line to De La Vega? He's going to keep the ball here. Can he win the header? He can. Martinez. That's a really bad tackle, that, from... Uh, I don't know who that was. Jack Rodwell, of all people. Right, now we've got a good chance here to get a decent shot off at goal. Can we do so with Almiron here? Let's see. Almiron steps up. And it's in. Oh, what a goal. Almiron with the free kick has absolutely smashed that in. Up and over. Oh, Almiron, you beauty. Oh, what a goal. I didn't realise that went in. I couldn't really tell. Oh, look at that. You'll love to see it. In off the post. Almiron with his second goal of the game, 15th of the season in the Prem, and it's 2-0 now against Sheffield United. Luka Bakio in a lot of space here. Can he get the shot away? Blocked. Foden wins it back. Luka Bakio. Oh my god, what a save by the keeper. Dean Anderson has just smacked him in the face, I think. Or the chest. Alright, ball whipped in. Almiron. Good ball in. Konate is there. Ah, oh, that's well wide. Almiron. Good ball out to Della Vega. Almiron's making that run back inside. Almiron for the hat trick. He shoots and it's saved by Henderson. Corner now. Ball whipped in from De La Vega. That's actually a really nice pass. Shaw was there. Tongi. Oh, I can't get around McBurney there. Here comes Sheffield United on the counter attack from that corner. Sanderberg played into McBurney. That's a great switch. All the way out to Osborne. Is this. Is Jonathan onside? I. Don't know. He is. He is. And he scored. 2-1 in the 88th minute. We've got to be careful here, lads. Because we're 2-1 up. We've comfortably sailed through this game. And now Sheffield United have scored off a counter-attack. I'm just going to keep trying to keep the ball now. Luka Bakio. Bit of a heavy touch there. I'm just going to keep the ball um, and see the game off now, I think. Almiron. Luka Bakio, maybe one last chance. Cuts it back. Almiron's there. Oh, no. Anyway, that should be game over. And it is. We win that game and we move on into the big game, the game we've been waiting for. 
the semi-final of the FA Cup against Liverpool. Right then, guys, the last game of the episode is the biggest one of the season. It's the semi-final of the FA Cup against Liverpool at Wembley. Let's see if we can try and get... I, don't, I literally, I'm lost for words right now. Hopefully, we can try and get to the final. Uh, I can't remember who the other semi-final is um, off the top of my head. But anyway, we're going to be running to the highlights. And hopefully, we can get a win here against Liverpool. Let's see how we get on. Here comes Salah now. Down the right-hand side for Liverpool. Cuts inside. Cuts back out. Jetro Willems is there, though. He's lost the ball, though. St. Maxim. Oh, God, that's a dangerous place to pass the ball. Liverpool now with Henderson. Good tackle from Willems. Counter-attack now. Almiron. Waiting for that switch from St. Maxim. He's got the pace of Trent. St. Maxim now. A lot of players forward here. We should be able to get a goal. St. Maxim, has he overdone it? He hasn't. It's 1-0 to Newcastle United in the semi-final against Liverpool. What a run that was and what a goal that was from St. Maxim. I thought I overdid the, um, the, the touches there. But he calmly called, puts it into the bottom corner. First goal in the FA Cup for him. One the up now against Liverpool. Let's see if we can carry this on. Camavinga with a great tackle near the halfway line. Waiting for that run of Martinez. He's thrown goal. Latoura Martinez. Can he get the goal? Martinez! It's 2-0 against Liverpool in the first half of this FA Cup semi-final. Camavinga with an absolute sensational tackle on the halfway line. Then he slides it through to Latoura Martinez. He bangs his, uh, our second goal of the game. And we're looking ever so closely to that FA Cup final spot now. Here we go now. Almiron bursting through. A lot of space here for Almiron. It's going all the way here. Almiron cuts it inside. Can he get the shot away? Almiron. Oh, what a goal. Oh, my days. It's 3-0 against Liverpool. I was expecting a much harder game like the Man City game we just had two games ago. Almiron absolutely does. Uh, Joel Matip in there with the fake shot inside, cuts it back, top corner, three goals for him in this FA Cups campaign. And I don't want to say it just yet, but I think that's us into the final of the FA Cup. Bonate, great tackle from him. De La Vega now has the chance to run out of it. Martinez, oh, he's lost the ball now. Oh, so Mars won it back beautifully. St. Maxim, has he got the pace of Trent? I think he does. Alan St. Maxim, penalty, and it is a penalty. Trent Alexander Arnold does a red card as well. What are you doing there? I'm going to bring Foden on in just a second after this penalty. I'm going to go bottom corner with Martinez now. Martinez, and it's a goal. I think that's game over, lads. Liverpool down to 10 with 4 0 up. I was not expecting this at all. And Martinez slots it coolly away. Uh, I'm going to bring Foden on for Camavinga. Um, because he is some, we've got some players that are really fatigued in this game. 4-0 uh, now. Let's see if we can just hold out and get to the final. Jolinton now. Oh, no. Oh, Martinez. Jolinton is through. Jolinton. Can he get his goal? Ball rolls to keep around him. Oh, my God. Jolinton. <laughs> what a goal. He sent Allison for days there. He's ball rolled the keeper around him. Smashes it into the back of net. It's 5-0 against Liverpool in the semi-final. Who would have predicted that? 11 goals in the FA Cup for your Linton this season. He has been on absolute fire in this competition for us. And that should now be game over. Closing into the added time of this game. What a game it's been. Again, it's kind of like the Bournemouth game. Um, when they got the red cards, when it was only 1-0. Uh, they kind of just crumbled here. Martinez, your Linton. Liverpool just crumbled here. Your Linton with another strike. And it's saved by Allison. Corner. Last chance of the game. Doesn't really matter because we've won anyway. Foden. Martinez. Now we're going to go all the way to Manquillo. And it's over. We've done it. And we're into the final. The FA Cup. What a campaign we're having in this FA Cup. Absolutely amazing. What a win to beat Liverpool. 5-0. We're going to go to the post-match interview. And who do we face in the next round? In the final. Is it, I think it will show us the result of the other game that played today. Spurs. Spurs being Leeds in the other semi-final. So we're playing Spurs in the final of the FA Cup. 
We're going to jump into the post-match interview just because it was a semi-final. Uh, I thought I'd do that for you guys. Congratulations on the amazing moment. What do you think made this win possible? Hard training and teamwork. Again, really, really good. Renate, he was very, very good again. Um, with two goals, Martinez. Remarkable performance, what do you think? Uh, an impressive performance, as always, from him. And before we do end the episode, we're going to go check the league table. Tournament prize money, 2 million so far. I wonder how much we get if we win it. So, here is the league table as things stand. So, as you can see, we are sat in a sixth position with a game in hand on Chelsea. Um, with that, we close the gap to two points if we do win our next game. Um, Spurs are on level games with two points behind, unfortunately. Um, let's go check the high... No, not the highlights. The games for the next episode, guys. So we do have... Oh, wow. That is a massive game for us. The next game is Spurs in the Premier League. Then we have Brighton, Watford... And then another game against Liverpool to end the Premier League season. And then we do have the FA Cup final, of course, against Spurs. Now, if we're being realistic, if we can beat Spurs, Brighton, Watford, I think that will put us in a really good position to get the top four. Anyway, that's the end of the episode. I hope you did enjoy. Make sure to leave a like, comment and subscribe if you did enjoy today's video. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.